I am Top Winter Springs Realtor Scott Garrison with Remax Town and Country and we're at 1783 Seneca Boulevard, Winter Springs, Florida, 32708. Here in Tuscawilla in the community of Chelsea Woods. If you're looking for this house at 1783 Seneca, one here in Chelsea Woods or Tuscawilla or anything in Winter Springs, call me. Me help you too. I've been selling real estate full time every day for 30 years this year, right here in the area. I can probably help you too. Purpose of this video is to give you a feel for what you can't see if you look at the best pictures online on Zillow, Realtor.com, Trulia, Homes.com. How do I know? Because I am the one who took those pictures and posted them that you see everywhere. What we want to do is we want to walk away from the house first, give you a feel for the neighborhood. One of the things you hear, people calling me from New York, internationally, what's the neighborhood like? The only way you're really going to get that, spend a couple of minutes looking at the neighbors. Here's the answer for what the neighborhood like in this price range. Answer, as good as it gets, really. Pay a little more money and get one of the few new homes out here. You'll be small little stucco boxes with no trees. Here, they're established houses built in the 80s. You can see people investing money upgrade their house right here as we speak. This neighborhood is right near the expressway, the 417, the heart of Oviedo, which has got some of the most affluent demographics in Central Florida. And Tuscawilla, best part of Winter Springs, people love it here. The trees, established neighborhood, golf course community. I'm sure you can find online information about Tuscawilla as a community, the golf course, but mostly you can tell Tuscawilla from as soon as you walk or drive into the community. The quality of the houses, the care, obviously it's a super affluent area. And here in Chelsea Woods, you get all of this. Nice neighborhood, no through traffic. And the HOA is optional. Just a couple of bucks a year. And if you want to be the Grinch, you don't even have to participate. You can see as we're walking up and down the street, we're seeing established trees. This is rush hour. Peak time, you see just a car every once in a while going down the road. Great place to have your kids play, the neighborhood, and it just doesn't get any better in Orlando in this price range for the wow factor of your friends and your family. Come see you, start driving through Tuscawilla, start driving down this street and go, oh! You live here, that house, right? Yeah, that house right there. On that huge lot, huge house, nestled with oak trees. Look at that. The number three rules for real estate are location, location, location. And you can tell this was before they started just clear cutting everything and then planting little tiny trees to grow up. Got established trees, original neighborhoods, quiet. And what a great location. Get to the airport, probably 30 minutes. I live nearby. If you look on the map, Orlando, Disney World, but Disney World's at the far edge of Orlando. About as far as you can get, still be in Orlando. And I can be to Disney World in 45 minutes. And when I say a trip, I mean that's a trip. I can be at the beach, world famous Cocoa Beach, in probably 30 or 40 minutes also. 
So this is your house right here. If you want to compete with your neighbors, probably have more curb appeal through architecture than any of them. So remember the purpose of this, all these people who want a virtual tour. Well, here it is, two car garage, side entry, big pool in the back, house is four bedrooms. We got two full bathrooms. We got two half bathrooms. Thirty five hundred and seventy two square feet living area and the slab forty seven hundred and forty square feet and live in a thirty six hundred square foot house. Holy cow. Now it's really important that we pause and say this is your view of the world, literally out your front door. For anything less than about 900,000. This is as good as it gets. Let's go in. So welcome home. The whole house radiates taste, sophistication, you have arrived and like you are and let you like to walk on zebras. Pretty nice. Those stairs were handmade from single blocks of real wood. We'll go up later. That was the formal living area or drawing room or study. This is the dining room here. Chandelier does not convey, but will be replaced by something similar. And the kind of kitchen that anyone would love. So big, it's hard to get it all in one shot. So you've got the open to the dining room. One of the other living areas here. That's a kitchen. Taxes on this house are only $4,652 with Homestead. That's pretty darn low, especially if you're coming from New York. Doing a circle around the laundry room here. So much space, well kept, and it's got a feel. It's not all generic like the new homes that they build. Painted white brick fireplace. That is not something you can get made anymore. Half bath here. Great schools here in Tuscaloosa, Lawton Childs Elementary. Oviedo High School, Indian Trails Middle. This house was built in 1987 and obviously has been upgraded many times since then. So the room with the zebra was a formal living room, drawing room, study. And this is another living room here. Give you that sense of space. Leading out to the pool, so much to see. We can't see all at once here. Okay. 
Bedrooms are all upstairs. Let's go outside here. Now we're out on the huge back lanai. That was the room we were just in right there. Got all kinds of bird life. Got your own river comes through here. I think the timer just shut off. Water comes out of there, goes down the river, into the little lake. And of course, look at that pool. Quality of the Marsite looks brand new. So much space, so many places to entertain, for family, kids. Two zoned ACs, of course. Let's go back in. All right, we're back in the kitchen. Part of walk through the house is to give you a feel for the floor plan. Just enough creak in the stairs. You know they're not some pre-packaged product. Look at those. You can tell I love the stairs. Nice size foyer here, master. Two bedrooms, bath, bedroom right there. This master is everything you would expect as far as size, ceiling. Look at that. The bedroom that I was raised in is smaller in this closet. So big it's even got room for a chandelier. I just did the California closets in my bedroom last week and that ain't cheap. But the best part is this unbelievable bathroom. Look at that dual shower head. You couldn't even rent a bed and breakfast that would be this nice. Live here, think of the money you'll save traveling. You'll just want to stay home. With all the bedrooms upstairs, this would be bedroom number two. Bedroom number three. Enough chandeliers for you. Bedroom number four. These are not small rooms. Like they used to make them only in the 80s. Try finding this in a new home. Look at that closet. Goes up, up, and up.
You see, it's like brand new. So we're back out front. If you're even thinking about living here in Winter Springs, Tuscaloosa, or Chelsea Woods, call me Top Winter Springs Realtor, Scott Garrison with Remax Town & Country. You friends, your family, will not believe the amount of house you've got for this money. Give me a call. Thanks. <music>